Since 1947, the World Affairs Council has become the preeminent global stage for world leaders and the public to inform, engage, and debate the most important issues of our time. It's your world. Get to know it. Last year in 2008, September 2008, both the Venezuelan ambassador in uh, the U.S. ambassador in Venezuela, the, His Excellency uh, Patrick Daddy and myself, because of the difference between our countries, we were, we were returned to our capitals. And uh, in the case of Venezuela, that was a decision made by the government in solidarity with Bolivia that had at that time uh, declared persona non grata, the then U.S. ambassador in, in Bolivia. And of course, uh, U.S. Uh, also, they, they declared myself persona non grata. Venezuela is a very rich country regarding energy that allows us to do things that probably other countries could not do it. And Chile has done apparently good in economic terms, but you cannot forget 15 years of the most horrible dictatorship that happens in, in Chile. So are you, are you saying that if we want to copy Chile, we have to go also through the process of when you, for example, um, destroy the unions and, you know, things like that. So it's a tricky question because it's not a, it's not a real question. The real question is how we address the issues how we understand the difference among countries, and um, and how, how we res and, and respect a mutual respect of different positions uh, of different countries. Venezuela is much more important in terms of products than in terms of crude oil, and this is something that uh, I always want to refer to people. You don't do anything with crude oil. If I give you crude oil, the only chance you have is to find a refinery to refine it because you cannot do anything. So the problem is not only who has the oil, the crude oil, who has the refining capacity. And as you know, in the U.S. there is a lack of investment in refining for years. So Venezuela is always number one regarding products, even if we are number third, number four regarding crude oil, what we, uh, the more strategic or important relationship is the, the, the gasoline or the products. And even in the midst of a lot of uh, political problems with the U.S., in the Katrina disaster, Venezuela was able to, to bring to the U.S. extra gasoline that helped a lot because we, have only, we are only five days shipping time to the Gulf of Mexico. While if you were waiting for gasoline coming from Europe or from the Middle East, you are talking about 25 days to 40 days.